here are today's winners for the huge pets. Congratulations. If you guys want a chance to win a free huge happy rock, all you have to do, like the video, subscribe, and leave a comment down below with your Roblox name. Donkey Kong, congratulations. And legendary Moshi, thank you for watching and congratulations on your huge happy rock. Go ahead and sell it, trade it, keep it, whatever you guys want to do. Don't forget guys, leave a comment and like the video for today's chance at a free huge. Let's get right into it. What's up guys? My name is D Field and welcome back to a brand new episode of Pet Simulator 99 here on Roblox. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a couple more leaks to talk about today in the upcoming update. And as you guys can see right over here, we have just under five days remaining. The next update is going to be coming to Pet Simulator literally this weekend. So I hope you guys are excited for it. Before we do get to the update, there are a couple more things that we do need to show you guys. A lot of different leaks coming through on X and on Twitter. So make sure you guys do follow me on there as well. But in today's episode, we're going to be talking about how you guys watching can actually win your very first free huge pet. In this upcoming update, there are a couple of things that they're going to be adding, which will allow us to perhaps get a huge pet and get a whole bunch of different prizes as well. Let's start off the episode by pulling up the big games Twitter as we always do to see some of these leaks. You guys can see right here, just two hours ago, they leaked that the next update, there are flying gifts. Shoot them down for a present. You guys all know this by now. These floating presents always have a chance to hatch a huge pet, or maybe there's a chance to even get some rare enchanted books and some rare items as well. Scrolling down into the comments, you guys can see that a couple of users have seen the slingshot item. Obviously, we're going to be able to use this slingshot to kind of shoot down these presents. A lot of people are also reminded of the Animal Crossing game where they do have a slingshot with these balloon presents. I want to know from you guys as well. Leave a comment down below. Let me know your guys' thoughts. What kind of prizes do you guys think you're going to be able to get from these actual presents? Me personally, guys, I am crossing my fingers and I hope that the presents have a chance to hatch a huge pet because I don't know about you. Over the past couple of days, I have not had any luck at all hatching any of these active huges back here. So I don't know, man. I might start focusing on trading just a little bit more in the next coming weeks, just depending on what the clan battle ends up being because I am having zero luck whatsoever hatching one of these huges. It's been almost a week since my last hatch. Have you guys also had this much of bad luck here on PS? 99 trying to hatch a huge pet? I feel like I'm the unluckiest person ever. Now, as we all expected, Rebirth number three is also going to be upcoming in this next update. A lot of us have already guessed this just because you guys could see the Rebirth Angel in the next gate. A lot of players are speculating all the different things that you can actually get from rebirthing. And as we all know, we'll probably get increased damage from this rebirth. And on top of that, we'll restart in area number one and then probably unlock the brand new area. Last but not least, one of the biggest leaks that came from this weekend is right here, guys. They're adding once again a lucky block world. Break the lucky blocks for the prizes. Check it out, guys. The lucky block world is very similar to what we've seen in the past. There's a lucky block goal of 5,000. Reach for a black lucky block. So this black lucky block is probably going to be what includes the different prizes and items for this upcoming update. I don't know about you guys, but I am crossing my fingers because I want a huge pet to be hatchable from that actual lucky block. Yo, what's up, QQ dog man? Welcome to the video. In the past, I do believe if I'm not mistaken, let's check this actual index real quickly. You guys can see by looking into the index, they actually did add a couple of different types of pets from this actual lucky block. So you guys can see right here, there is a huge chroma lucky block mimic. And I'm thinking there's probably gonna be a chance to hatch some sort of lucky block. We don't know if it's going to be a huge pet or if it's just going to be one of the exclusive variants. We're literally four days away from finding out what is going to be coming in this upcoming update. The one thing I do have to say about this lucky block update, guys, does it feel a little bit reused? Do you know what I mean? I feel like last year for PSX, the lucky blocks were also a very similar update. I really hope that this time around, they buff the drops just a little bit in this black lucky block that they're 
are talking about right here just so maybe we have a chance to get a huge pet or maybe even a titanic only time will tell those are basically the big leaks that big games talked about this past weekend there's a couple players here hanging out while we're doing this bit in our video so what we're gonna do let's give them a quick little present we got qq dog man we got eee -E -E over here there's a couple players let's give this guy a free exclusive pet qq dog man let's give him one of the very small ones we're not gonna give him a huge because you guys in the community have to obviously get a little bit of that but we can give him one orange you know what let's give him two orange axolotls ty for watching dude give him a little smiley face and send that away and then let's pick one more of them who's hanging out over here bb what's his name right there bb bevum he looks like a noob playing on mobile we gotta show him a little bit of love where is he in at this actual lobby i don't see his name oh there he is there he is let's go ahead and send bb Evan M, and then we'll go ahead and instead of sending him a pet, thank you for watching the videos. We're actually going to be sending him 500,000 diamonds. Let's see if he goes ahead and enjoys that for the day. Hey, QQ Dogman says, Thank you. Of course, my friend. Thank you for watching. I do want to head on over to Flower Field because we need to refresh all of our diamonds for some free ones right now. But all of you guys watching right now, how excited are you for update number five? I know we've been waiting for this for almost two weeks and it feels like a very long time but to be completely honest I do think that the PS99 devs needed a little bit of a break after the Christmas updates in order to kind of stockpile and give bigger and better updates out a quick interruption we're gonna harvest all of these diamonds and I'm gonna try to see how many diamonds we can get in one little harvest session without resetting the diamond count in the center of your screen so I've noticed that if you literally open all of these pretty quickly you will get the proper diamond diamond amount on your screen so all of those right there about a hundred and eleven thousand diamonds not too bad at all and I've been slowly stockpiling all of these diamond seeds again I ended up going through about 350 of them but over the past couple of weeks while I've been afk hatching we've obviously been receiving oops I accidentally hit home we've obviously been receiving a whole bunch of seed plants like those seed bags so we've slowly but surely been able to stockpile a whole bunch more of these diamond plants this is one of those things that I do literally probably Probably about four or five times every single day as soon as I hop onto PS99 because it literally takes you less than two minutes to do and a hundred to 150,000 gems with two minutes of work is always worth it in my opinion if you guys are doing this greenhouse for literally one week alone as long as you guys have this half of the greenhouse unlocked you yourself will have a chance to get and afford your free huge pet another one of the many methods that are now available to you guys here on PS99 in order to get your very first huge pet and honestly there are just so many different opportunities now to get these huges and I hope you guys are utilizing all of the different events that are going to be coming into the game very shortly I do want to go ahead and buy some OP potions real fast over here oh man a lucky eggs potion are you serious check this out I've been stockpiling on some of the high tier potions and man we've got a good assortment of them right now I'm basically just running non-stop potions whenever I am farming and then look at all of our fruit stockpile dude we literally have over 20,000 of each and every single one of these fruits a good little collection starting and brewing up now right before we end this video a quick little confession I have been selling a lot of crystal keys and a lot of different items that have been kind of uh, amassing just because I do have this treasure hunter book equipped if you guys have noticed some of my alt accounts in the trading plazas I've been selling some high tier books I've been selling a lot of those high tier potions that I've been showing you guys and we have been making some good money now fortunately enough for us all of the saved money is slowly but surely expanding all of our rainbow and shiny huge pop cat collection I'm really looking forward to actually completing the set and we are about 15 to 20 pop cats away and then once we do that we can finally focus on trading up for some valuable items here on PS 99 trading ladies and gentlemen I hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode and I hope you guys are pushing for your very first huge pet here in the upcoming update. Update number five is right around the corner. We'll be giving you guys all the different tips, tricks, and leaks in the next update. My name is D-Field. We'll see you guys again next time. Peace.